Nintendo announced a direct tomorrow, but it may not be what you think. Let's talk about it. With E3 canceled this year, all of the other companies seem to have their announcements around the same time as usual, but Nintendo's been oddly absent. There's been a lot of rumors going around about when Nintendo's going to announce their direct. The earlier in the month, everyone's saying it's going to be June 8th. Then everyone said it's definitely going to be June 15th. On the 22nd, we did get a Nintendo direct, but it was specifically for Xenoblade Chronicles 3. And then last week, everyone's saying June 29th, absolutely going to be a full-on Nintendo direct. Today, Nintendo announced the direct mini tomorrow, but still hasn't said anything about a full Nintendo direct. Nintendo tweeted this morning announcing a Nintendo Direct Mini happening tomorrow at 6am Pacific Time. So what can we expect from the Direct tomorrow? Well, it's going to be a partner showcase, which is going to be 25 minutes of third-party games. So nothing first-party from Nintendo, so no Metroid or Mario or anything like that. 25 minutes doesn't seem like a lot, but Nintendo does have a pretty good track record of packing a lot of games into their events. They'll probably have a couple of montages of a bunch of games being announced at one time. Seeing some extra games being announced for the Nintendo Switch Online service, like Nintendo 64, Super Nintendo NES games, things like that, that are third-party games, that would be really cool. I don't necessarily think that would happen tomorrow because this is really meant for third-party titles uh, and announcing things for Nintendo's own service might be a weird choice, but that would really be cool if they did announce that. I'm hoping we get to see more about Bayonetta 3. It was announced about five years ago, and I believe last year they did say it was going to come out in 2022, but there still hasn't really been anything about it yet. It would be kind of cool if they shadow dropped it or said, hey, it's going to release like next week or something crazy like that. Even though I've never played any of the Persona series, it would be really cool to see those on the Switch. I know we did receive Persona 5 Strikers, which really was one of those like Warriors kind of games where you just fought a bunch of enemies and it wasn't like one of the actual titles. But at this point, we haven't really seen any Persona games otherwise. The Final Fantasy Pixel Remasters would be really cool to see on Switch. I know we did get an announcement, I want to say earlier this year in around January, that they were coming to Switch, but I haven't really seen too much about them recently. But that would be really cool to have that announced, maybe even just available that day. There were some rumors that the Skyrim Anniversary Collection was going to be released on Switch. Um, I haven't really heard too much about it, but that would be really cool. I know the Xbox and Bethesda just had their event earlier this month, and if they were going to announce that, maybe they would then. Although it was an Xbox event, so I really doubt they would tell you about a Switch version. But since this is a partner showcase, maybe they'll announce it here. I know the last thing that Bethesda needs to be doing is re-releasing Skyrim again. But since they've already released the Anniversary Edition, you might as well put it on Switch too. Although we did get some information about Hollow Knight, Silk Song, and the Xbox and Bethesda event, it would be cool to see something tomorrow. Although Hollow Knight is technically considered an indie game, so that might be something that would have been on the indie showcase, so I'm not sure it'll be on tomorrow's direct. It's probably a no-brainer to show more Monster Hunter Sunbreak material. It does come out two days after the direct, so it'd really get people hyped for the game. I think the great thing about this direct is that we don't have a lot of information about it, so really anything can happen. When what do you think about the direct tomorrow? What games are you excited about seeing, and do you think Nintendo's gonna have a full-on direct anytime soon, or do you think we'll have to wait till something like September for the full-on direct? Let me know in the comments below. If you really enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. It really does help out the channel. It tells YouTube this is a great video and more people should see it. And if you want to see more videos about gaming and gaming news, please hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos.